is asking is there any particular team that you would like to see ukraine play against on international style and international yes level? yes absolutely it will be the for me the, the the highlight of my career if i can get our ukrainian team and i already spoken to him about it uh to against sweden with john t rhodes the head coach i would love that to play and i believe my Ukrainian team would beat the Swedish team with John T. He doesn't agree, but that to me would be the ultimate. And uh, yeah, I would love to play against John T's team. Sorry, I said Gary, John T's team, yeah. Swedish team. You've got a lot of South African connection with you in life, right? <laughs> like John T. Rhodes, Gary Custon, South African director. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I think the thing with Gary and John T probably, it's so funny that uh, I just have, I'll, I'll, You know, I, I know a lot of the South African cricketers, like Daryl Cullen and some mate to find these guys. It's it's just you know, we, it's, it's the cricket community in South Africa. It's not like India. Mm -hmm. India is so big. I think a lot of these guys only meet each other when they get selected for the Indian team. They meet some guys for the first <laughs> time. But in South African cricket, we all know each other. You play schools cricket against each other, your province against other province. So we all, it's a small community. So we all know each other and. John T and Gary, this this Indian, I always call it the Indian thing, the Indian <laughs> connection. Uh, I think it's when we I call them Indians, but you know, John T Rhodes and Gary both we call them Indians only. They're not South Africans <laughs> for us. Like and and I'll add AP De Villiers as well. Like we all love oh, him yeah. so much that we can't really call them South Africans anymore. They are Indians. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think John T sees himself as Indian. You know, his daughter is named India. Yeah, exactly. With yoga, his wife Mel is a yoga teacher. Uh, John T spends more more time in India than anywhere else. Um, he's, 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 he's really a, a, a Indian. I mean, he serves in India. He does yoga there. His daughter's in there. Uh, he, he's become an honorary Indian. And yeah. I know for a fact both of them. The, the highlight of their cricket time every year is that IPL tournament where they back in India. They back with their players. They both absolutely love it. It's it's the best. Month of the six weeks of the of the year is when they when they're in India again. And my own experience when I went to Chennai to see um, Ashwin, I met his wife Pretty and the two daughters at his house. I mean, I, it's so funny. I just feel I belong. I think because everybody loves cricket. You go in the taxi uh, taxi driver immediately sees you, he hears you're South African. He starts, oh, do you know John? Do you know Gary? Do you know AB? <laughs> he starts talking cricket. Everywhere you go in India, you can't get away from cricket. Now I'm cricket is my life. Um, and and I think that's why I got this absolute love for anything Indian. I went last night in in Zagreb. There's a fantastic little Indian restaurant, Bombay or something. And I go there probably three four nights a week.